Today I'm going to show you how to simply create three-dimensional text in AutoCAD. I'm using AutoCAD version 2018, but this method should work with previous versions as well as the new versions that are being released. So I'm going to start out by making a new drawing, and I'll give it a second to load. Okay. So the first thing we're going to do is create two-dimensional text. So we're going to type T. And we can make our box and create our text. Now I'm just going to spell out the word AutoCAD. Make sure my cap locks isn't on. All right. And from there, we're going to adjust all the settings we want because this is going to be very difficult to adjust later on. So from here, I will change my font size. And I will change, let's see, I'll bold it. And I'll change my font style. Okay, once we have all that set, we can click out of the box and we have our two dimensional text. From here, we're just going to select the text and we're going to type out text exp. That is our text explode command. We'll hit enter and you can see it turned our two dimensional text into a bunch of different polygons. We want all these to be individual line segments. So what we're going to do is we're going to select it once more, type X for the normal explode command. And now these should all be individual line segments. From here, we have to clean up the text. So all of these unnecessary lines that AutoCAD creates, we can just remove. Okay, once you've got that all cleaned up, one more, once you've got that all cleaned up, what we're going to do is we need to join these back together into polygons. So we're going to select the entire thing once more, type in J for our join command, and now there should be separate polygons created for each of these. Some if uh, Sometimes they won't connect. Um, you can try joining those individually. And then we get another one. So just make sure that all of them do join up um, correctly. Because if they're two separate segments, they will not uh, extrude. So from here, we can rotate ourselves into our 3D space. Come up to our extrude command. Select the entirety of your text. And we can pull that straight up. Just like that. From there, I'm going to switch out of 2D wireframe. And the first thing you'll notice is that uh, all of our letters that have holes in them did not create the holes. So the reason for that is because there were two segments and each of them extruded separately. So we have our main 3D solid and then we have a smaller 3D solid inside. So to solve that, we're just going to come up to our subtract tool, select the solid that you'd like to keep, hit enter, select the solid you'd like to remove, hit enter, and we have our hole. And we can go ahead and do that for all the letters. Okay, so there we go, we have 3D text, and I just noticed on my model here that I have uh, a separate 3D solid here uh, because I, I failed to remove a line. What we can do there is just use our join tool, or our union command rather, and now it's one solid piece. All right, so there you have it, simply created three-dimensional text in AutoCAD. This will work with any font, um, I would say certain fonts work better for this kind of thing than others.